Hi, I'm Shep, one of the friendly board certified entomologists with Rose Pest Solutions. And we're going to look at how to identify bed bugs. You've seen the pictures, but do bed bugs really look like that in their natural setting? We've all seen insects, but if you're not used to looking at insects, they can kind of all look the same. Let's get some close ups of what bed bugs look like and some idea of how big they really are. Let's start with the eggs. They're not microscopic as is often reported, but they're very sm uh, small. Um, they're very little. They're uh, tiny, tiny. They're itty. Uh, they're they're teeny little things. Here we have a couple of eggs amongst some grains of salt, so you can get some idea of what size they really are. They are so small as to be overlooked. Generally, they're white, uh, but they uh, show up pretty well in a dark background. The eggs are tiny, and the first little stage out of the egg is just as tiny. First instar nymphs can be almost impossible to see. They go through five stages. So a first instar nymph is the first stage out of the egg. A second instar nymph is a little bigger, little bigger yet. Uh, third instar nymphs. Starting to attain some size. Uh, fourth instar nymphs are bigger yet. The little uh, black smudge you see in there is actually the remnants of a blood meal in their gut. These are adults. At three eighths of an inch, they're pretty easy to see. This is, uh, this is a cast skin. Bed bugs grow by molting. They cast off a skin, and the bed bug that comes out swells a little bigger. And thus, bed bugs grow stage by stage. Nasty little parasites. 